Hi, I'm Jason Bennett. Welcome to Sunday Afternoon Footy. We're coming to you from Punt Road Oval. This is the second elimination final between Richmond and North Melbourne. A season's toil ends tonight for one of these sides, while the other will play in a semi-final next week. And out they come, led by their skipper. I'm joined by Kelly Underwood. Great to have you along, Kel. How do you see this one unfolding? G'day, Jason. I like the Tigers. I thought for a while this side was capable of making the top four, but they didn't get there. If they can overcome today's hurdle, they'll be confident of progressing further. An interesting perspective. Thanks, Kelly. A real buzz around the stadium as the captains meet for the toss. Feel the excitement around the ground. It's been building steadily. Seymour wins the first tap. Hosking inside 50 with the kick. Good thinking and good execution too. Has she got enough on it? Punched away. Danger averted. Frantic defence. Back into play. Generosity is a wonderful quality but not on a football field. She'll fancy her chances. Looks a good kick off the boot. It is. They've got the first. She might just be in for a big day. The Tigers are up and about early. Seymour wins it out of the centre. Egan, the midfield battle, so important. Quality delivery by foot. Searching kick. Great body work. This to make a good start, a very good one. She doesn't miss many of these, and she hasn't missed that one. They produced a clinical finish there to cap off a terrific passage of play. The Tigers, away to a flyer. Seymour wins it down. Egan knew the tackle was coming. Clever kick. McKenzie, they're playing with purpose and composure. Bresnahan, can she mop up? Terrific forward pressure. Was that a legitimate attempt to get it out? The umpire gives her the benefit of the doubt. Seymour with the tap. Egan, desperate defence. Going for her first, only behind. If they can keep running and taking the game on, there's no reason why they can't create lots of opportunities in front of goal. Hardeman to bring it in. What can they muster from the back half? Good kick. Bruton on a lead. The ruse, looking shaky early. No one can mark. Lynch is a real pocket rocket. Conti. The Tigers are playing some great footy. Leaves it behind. Gavalis, ever reliable. Thought her way through it. Lynch, desperate to win it back. Conti, all alone in the centre square. Can she hit a target? Good disciplined defence. McKenzie, three in a row coming up. What a patch they're having. The Tigers are really attacking the contest and looking dangerous when they get the ball forward. The Roos are in danger of being run over. Egan, she's besieged. Garner, Riddell, throws it on the boot. Dempsey, belts it clear. Sheeran, it's one for the high flyers. No one can mark. And we'll have a throw in. Daniel Harford is with us. What do you make of this one, Half? The Roos aren't doing their forwards any favours here. It might be time for the coach to switch things up. Seymour palmed it down beautifully. It's a tough game. Riddell hunting the footy. Carney 
gets the kick away. Wall. That one was always hers. This would give her a shot of confidence. She converts and narrows the margin. It doesn't matter who you are, it's always good to get an early one on the board. The Roos have opened their account. Matza with the tap. Rizel, Garner. They're a big chance here. As Dennis would say, the kick was sort of perfect. Kicking at her first. Liked it off the boot. That's going close. She'll be eyeing off a bag today if her teammates keep putting it on a platter for her. They've pegged them back nicely. This is an entertaining match. Kelly with a deft tap. Egan. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? Conti only knows one way. Wakefield has it within range. She's not on the board yet. That should change here. She's normally dependable, and she is this time. It's too early to panic, but they might think about making a couple of changes before a bad start becomes worse. The Tigers making all the running early. Punched clear. Riddell leading from the front. Delivers it inside 50. King takes on the responsibility, just needs to finish, and finish she does. She's looking ominous already. There might just be a big bag on offer today. The goals are coming thick and fast. This is great to watch. King, Riddell, Gunner under pressure. Can't afford to give it back in the corridor. Oh, good tackle. Got to get it out of there. Probing ball. Mackenzie, Egan in the right spot. She's been busy so far. Ferguson takes an excellent grab. Her field kicking is normally first rate. No one can mark. Egan, Mackenzie. Met solidly. They want ball there, but they're not going to get it. Great ruck work. Egan, they'll need to limit her influence. Mackenzie marks inside 50 and can have a shot. I'll back her to drive this right through the middle. Drop punt. That'll be a goal. Never in doubt. She's causing all sorts of problems for them. They might need to make a change already. The Roos have been slow out of the blocks. Matza palmed it down beautifully. Cop some unwanted attention. Conti, how will the umpire see this? King drives it inside the forward 50. No one can mark. Sheeran, they're all over them early. Hosking, good looking kick. Conti. The Tigers have started well. Egan, she's hit up the lead. These half chances can often be the difference. For a second goal today. Not quite, she's missed. Perhaps she should have looked to lay that one off. She'd miss more of those than she'd kick. Hardeman to bring it back in. Manages to find a teammate. Doesn't often waste it. Bresnahan with a chance to relieve the pressure. The Roos not at their best so far. The Tigers are bringing great energy. Kylie at half forward. Wakefield marks. That's hard to stop. Normally a reliable kick. Can she make this one count? Drop punt, looks good, and she's got it. The Tigers going from strength to strength. They've got all the answers at the minute. The Roos need to get one back soon. They're right on the edge here. King out of the congestion. Riddell, Garner works hard to present. Going for a first. Defence 101 there. Happy to concede a behind. Sheeran goes towards half back. Thumped away. And out it goes. Lots to analyse. Half, what stands out? The Roos look rattled. They do well to play a bit of possession footy and slow the game down for the next little bit. Rennie gets her hand to it. Mackenzie 
Careful with the kick. Egan normally delivers. No wonder coaches go grey. That's skillful. Shevlin wins the contest and can relieve the pressure. This term they're having. Garner couldn't mark, so she brings it to ground. Smith. It's a desperate tackle. Eddie King. She's going for home. And why wouldn't she with a finish like that? If she wasn't such a big ball winner, she would make a very decent forward. She's a goal sense. They've got 10 between them, and we're not yet at quarter time. Riddell. Garner. They need to hit the scoreboard here. King. That's a big play. This is an opportunity to settle some anxieties and get their team into the contest. It'll take her best. Not looking likely a behind. Nothing wrong with having a go, but it might have been a better option to set that one up to the top of the square. Back into play. Riddell trying to bring the crummers into play. You can never question her commitment. Kelly, can she find a teammate? Disappointing footy there. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. King on centre wing has marked. Heads towards half forward. No one can mark. Cordner, and they're out of trouble. Hosking, they've had the better of the contest to this point. Egan, handball was good. She's been dispossessed. She doesn't waste many. Cox. Can she impose herself on the match? No one can mark. Egan. Navigate. Lynch. Going for her first. One behind only. It seemed like the defenders got a little bit lost there and they were lucky not to give up a goal. Away she goes. Back into play. Eddie. That's good work rate. The ruse. Might be able to start something. Randall. Working hard and presenting well. Garner. Ignoring the corridor for now. Brown had her name written all over it. King. The kick despite the heat. Sheeran is there in defence. The Tigers are up and about early. Good thinking and good execution too. What she got on offer. No one can mark. Riddell. Heads towards the hard flank. Brown. It's a hot footy. Garner will take some stopping. Touch and go. They did well to construct that shot at goal, but the inability to convert really let them down. Sheeran to bring it back in. Honours the lead. This might be a chance for the High Flyers. Thumped away. Wakefield. She stopped in her tracks. No prior opportunity, so we'll have a ball up. Ready, looking for territory. Hosking. She's drawn a crowd. Cox. They're going nowhere and we'll have a stoppage near the centre. Rennie showing her skills. Bruton, a model of consistency. They're moving the football quickly. Cordner had the presence of mind to get to the dangerous spot. That's good vision. Conti. She might have thought about the corridor. The great Spud Frawley would have loved that one. Hosking, she's run into trouble. Does well under pressure. Shevlin, picking their way through. Cox is the target and she marks. The Tigers have come to play and are threatening to open up a decent gap on the scoreboard. Set sail for home and delivers. There are some danger signs already. This is looking like it could become one-sided. have opened up a break. Rennie wins it. They've got a good understanding, those two. The Tigers forcing them out wide. Brown pounces on the loose ball. Can she be the fire starter? Abitangelo gets on the end of it. That's great footy. If she can nail this first shot at goal, she might just be in for a big day. The ball's in the right hands and she's delivered. She could kick a bag today if the delivery continues to be that good. The Ruse have closed within three kicks. Rennie smashes it out of there. Bruton, Riddell, what can she do with it? There goes the kick inside the 50. Miller swoops, kicks to centre wing. No one can mark. The Ruse should score here. Punched away. Miller, no easy exit. The umpire will have it. 
Who can get the clearance? Hosking, the Tigers, playing like winners. Egan, Shevlin, takes the hand pass. Conti, Yasir, farms it out. Good build up. Squeezes the kick. Wakefield has been a real live wire. To extend the margin beyond three goals. Two already. Can she make it three? You bet she can. She's kicked beautifully at goal today. Her confidence must be soaring. The Tigers showing why they were favourites to win this match. Rennie, the winner there. Bruton, Riddell, good handball. Carney can run and gun. Well done. Who's at home? Hosking saw that coming. They've got time to put the kettle on. Shevlin feeds it out. Conti, they're building something dangerous here. This is promising. Yasir takes the mark and can extend the margin. Kylie on the end of it. They're cutting them up with their ball movement. There are some alarm bells ringing is an understatement. They're not working hard enough. From the pocket. Looks good. Is good. She loved that one off the boot and the goal off the ball didn't have to move. Thought this might have happened, but we hoped it wouldn't. Rennie wins the tap. Bruton is cool under pressure. Brown, Garner, she will work all day. Knew the tackle was coming. And we'll do it all again. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. Garner loves the hard stuff. Conti intercepts the hand pass. Egan, Cordner can get it and go. Shevlin, great vision there. The Tigers look well drilled. As Dennis would say, that kick was centimetre perfect. Is anyone home? Rennie. It's no place for the faint-hearted. They might be a little unlucky not to be rewarded there. It was a fine tackle. Rucks go at it. Garner does the roving. Bruton. She's so clean with the footy. Outbodied her opponent and took a ripper. Kicks to space. Thumped away. Cox. She's set upon. They appeal for a free kick, but will have a stoppage. Rennie with a deft tap. Riddell needs a good decision. She's made a hot start to this game. Can she deliver? You back her more often than not. Heads goalward and she's off target. It's a disappointing miss, but she created an opportunity that perhaps not many would have. The Tigers have set down a marker and they're going to be hard to beat as the players retreat to their huddles. Let's head down to half on the boundary. The Roos have a lot of work to do. They were pretty ordinary in the first term. A good start to this quarter will get them believing again, but they've got the job ahead of them. Their opponents look very switched on. I'm inclined to agree. Thanks, half. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. They'll be sore in the morning. King. Dempsey tries to spike it out of the danger zone. Brown, they badly need a goal, and she delivers. They move that ball very well indeed. They're hard to defend at their skillful best. The Roos haven't played great footy, but they're hanging in there. Punched clear. Bruton, Riddell, the Tigers have denied them the corridor. King. The defence is disorganised. They've moved it well and given themselves a good look here. I'm not sure she's got the journey from there. They desperately need this. Miller takes an excellent grab. What can they generate? Quality delivery by foot. She's generally a good kick. Ferguson got a fist in. Shevlin. She'll be sore tomorrow. Could that have been holding the ball? Some thought it was, but not the person who matters. Rennie with the tap. Bruton. How will the umpire see this? Garner. Carney. They've worked it well. Riddell. In towards goal. She's made the goal umpire work. It must be her birthday. Plays the percentages. King wins it back. Great mark. The defence has fallen down. Abitangelo has a way of drawing the footy. Already got one today. 
she struck it well. We'll go close. Easy to say in hindsight, but that ball probably should have been centred. Miller brings it back in. She's hit up the lead. And they're away. Rennie heads them off at the pass. Heads for the pocket. No one can mark. Bruton going at her first, and she's got it. That's what happens when you leave players in space inside 50. It hurts you on the scoreboard. Both sides are cracking in hard right now. It's a great contest. Rennie got her palm to it. Riddell, Garner. She is everywhere at the moment. No one can mark. Right. Desperate defence. Bruton fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. The crowd cries, ball, and they get their wish. They'll bide their time. Who's front and centre? And out of play. Lots to analyse, Daniel. What stands out? The Tigers haven't been able to generate as many forward 50 entries as they would like, but they're still in front because they've been efficient with the ball. Bruton, she's wrapped up. Carney in the thick of it as ever. Kicks laterally. No one can mark. Right. It's a tough game. This for three on the trot, and she steers it through. It took longer than they would have liked, but they're playing some very good football now. The Roos are back in business. Rennie wins the hit out. Riddell is a dynamo. They could be in front in a minute. Dempsey belts it clear. Graham closed her down. Puts a teammate under the pump. Garner. Oh, that has to hurt. Shevlin is calm in a crisis. Terrific forward pressure. She ran into a brick wall. What can they build here? Cox. She put herself in the line of fire. She's caught. Graham. Shevlin can run and carry. Kelly. Out wide with the kick. Egan has found some space. Goes laterally. Wakefield has it within range. A question of accuracy, and she should be able to answer in the affirmative. Struck it well. No problems there. So important to get reward for effort. On that occasion, the finish matched the quality of the work upfield. The Tigers are holding them at bay. Rennie got her palm to it. Riddell. Bruton takes the logical option. King towards full forward. Punched away. Smith. Can she snap at goal? Garner. It's there. I wonder if the coach gave them a rocket at quarter time. They look a different side in this turn. The Roos have pulled it back to five points. Great ruck work. Bruton fighting hard. Bit of a nothing kick. Riddell delivers a long ball. Punched away. Cordner. A chance to clear now. That's an impressive mark. Whatever she's suffering from, it's not leather poisoning. Shevlin. Yasir. Met solidly. No way through that traffic, so they'll reset. Rennie with the tap. Shevlin. They cannot keep her quiet. Egan. Dangerous to leave her on her own. A good kick here and they'll be in business. Yasir. Kicks inside the forward 50. No one can mark. Reed. Goes at goal, but I think that's going the wrong side of the post. It is. It's a behind. A fine passage of play, but didn't get the finish it deserved. Brown goes towards half-back. Carney made that kick look good. Who was she aiming for? They've turned it over. Yasir. Centering ball. Wakefield has marked in front of goal. She'll have a handful if she converts this. Leans back and drills it. Well, it's one thing to take the contested mark, but another to have the composure to finish off your good work. Neither side able to string goals together. Rennie with the tap. Riddell. The defenders will be nervous. Thumped away. Bruton lurking dangerously. She's got one already. Will this be number two? She's missed. Some good work to create that shot on goal. 
but unfortunately the finish just let them down. Miller brings it back in. Egan working hard and presenting well. It's a high ball. Hardeman belts it clear. Rennie charges onto it. They've put themselves under pressure. Carney. Riddell needs to be quick. That's a bruising tackle. Smith. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? Right See on. something she likes. She's drawn a crowd. Not wanting to bomb to a contest. Shevlin. The ruse guarding the corridor. They're moving the football well here. Got to get it going forward now. That'll go close to the line. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. What are your thoughts, Daniel? It's good to see both sides kicking goals, but the coaches will keep trying to find ways to stymie each other and make goals harder to come by. Bruton, Riddell, what a game she's having. Garner. Big ball to be won here. Thumped away. Cordner was committed to the contest. Stoppage coming up on the wing. Rennie punches it out of the ruck. Mackenzie, she's run into trouble. Conti, they'll need to be more careful than that. Towards half forward with the kick. Brown, they've got them on the overlap. Wall on a lead. It's so important to be efficient in front of goal, particularly when it's tight on the scoreboard. From the seemingly impossible angle, well, it's not impossible for her. They've got five for the quarter now, and there's time for more too. The Roos with a 10-goal opening half. They've been so impressive. Rennie showing her skills. Riddell, Bruton, King. It's a hot footy. Manages to find a teammate. Lays it off. Heads for full forward. Cordner belts it clear. Can they work this ball out of defence? That might attract a pack. McKenzie. It's a high kick, a real rainmaker. Thumped away. Hardeman. Rennie. Lynch belts it clear. King on the spot to lay the tackle. Fantastic tackling technique there. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. Egan, McKenzie. Kicks to half forward. Wakefield, that's good work rate. Can anyone get to the drop zone? Punched away. Conti wins a hard ball. Stripped of it. Garner has time to measure the kick. Carney gives it everything. No one can mark. Cordner tumbles a punt towards the boundary line. Shevlin. Levy. She's had little impact so far. Conti at half forward. She's kicked it high. Punched away. And they see it out. What are your thoughts, Daniel? We've seen some quality attacking play so far. And hopefully it continues because it's been great to watch. Rennie wins the tap. Garner. Carney. Some indirect ball movement here. No one can mark. McKenzie. This will be touch and go. No one can mark. Gets it to safety. Back into play. Have they weathered the storm? They'll contest in the centre square. They could be vulnerable here. There goes the kick inside the 50. Lace out, great footy. She doesn't miss many, so you wouldn't think this one would pose any problems. Heads towards goal and does not let them down. That's the one they needed. They've had repeat inside 50s and finally they get some reward. The Tigers with a bit of breathing space now. Rennie, the winner there. Riddell rolling the sleeves up. The Ruse haven't been inside 50 for a while. King, some people can't kick that far. Looking to pull one back. That's exactly what she's done. Well played. They're a better team when she uses her pace and skills the way she did there. Great goal. Both sides have struggled to generate momentum so far. Rennie wins the tap. Riddell. King. She's set upon. Got the handball away. Bruton. It's a desperate tackle. McKenzie running in support. Boot to ball just in time. Rennie. She'll be sore tomorrow. Smith. 
She's gone. Hardiman. Garner. She just keeps racking up disposals. Good thinking and good execution too. Honours the lead. Going at her second. It's a thumping kick. Is it big enough? Miller saves the day. Brings it out wide. Cordner has a vice-like grip. Right, belts it clear. Reed. They'll be sore in the morning. Levy manages to keep it in. Both sides are making their share of mistakes. It's just a matter of who can punish their opposition the most. Kelly looking for territory. Conti, McKenzie. She's besieged. Reed. Into the pocket she goes. Hardiman is there to save the day. Can they get something going? As Dennis would say, that kick was certainly a perfect. Carney has charged into space. McKenzie went bang. Ah, what have you noticed down at ground level? The Tigers might be in front, but there's room for improvement with their kicking. They've been sloppy at times. Punch clear. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Shevlin, Conti, Reed. Solid tackle. Just shoveled it out. Egan. Towards the goal mouth. Punched away. The Roos are getting it forward enough, but it hasn't translated into enough goals at this stage. Who can get the clearance? No easy exit. Bruton into the middle with the kick. Rennie. She got under that one. Hosking went bang. Riddell had to get it out. King. She hasn't kicked it very well. Punched away. Rushed over and they can reset. Miller to bring it back in. Shevlin. Strong grab. Kelly dishes it off. Kylie. Wakefield. This is great ball movement. She's been quiet. That's a strong mark. Nothing better than to convert a big contested mark into a goal. Shouldn't miss from there, and she doesn't. She's playing her role to perfection. She's working hard to present, and she's kicking goals. But she's also been excellent defensively. The Tigers are keeping them at arm's length. Rennie with a deft tap. Riddell, Garner. Searching kick. Sheeran wins the contest and can relieve the pressure. Moving the football laterally. Graham gets to the front spot. Who will stand under that? Smith with the big fist. Down at ground level, half. The Roos need to generate better quality inside 50s. They're getting it in there okay, but not hitting the scoreboard as often as they'd like. Great ruck work. They've got good chemistry, those two. Conti decides to go. Clever kick. McKenzie on centre wing has marked. She's hit up the lead. She should have the distance, but I'm not sure she has. No one can mark. Brennan. That could be a goal-saving tackle. She's got it. Typical small forwards goal there. She's a real live wire inside 50. The Tigers with two on the bounce. Rennie wins it out of the centre. Bruton. Riddell. Up and under. Sheeran went bang. Matza is there. It's a goal. Their efficiency in front of the sticks has arguably kept them in this game. They're slugging it out, these two. It's been an entertaining first half. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. Bruton, Riddell. Key contest coming up. The Ruse got off to a poor start, but they've pulled it back admirably, and I believe they can go on and win. What's happening down there, half? Hard to pick a winner here. Both sides are doing a lot right. We may just have a close one on our hands. I can't see either side falling away. They're both desperate, both applying tremendous pressure. These teams look ready to go the distance. Couldn't agree more, Half. Thanks for that.
Rennie with the tap. Egan, great play. McKenzie can keep it moving. Bombs it in. Punched away. Clean pickup. She just dropped it. Levy, bad error there. Carney, normally creative. Penetrating ball. That's not a good kick. Incisive handball. Dempsey doesn't often waste it. Cox looking to extend this margin. Defence 101 there. Terrific forward pressure. She's completely shanked it. This will be coming back. It's out on the full. Must kick goal in a close match. Opportunity here. Bends it around the body. One behind. Miss one she should have got and let them off the hook. Hardeman tasked with the kick in. What can they muster from the back half? Ignoring the corridor for now. Quality delivery by foot. I've liked her game today. Garner. By hand. I think she called for that. Drives it inside the forward 50. Uses the body well. This is what she gets paid to do. Kick these goals. Touch and go. She'll be disappointed with that, but she'll back herself to make amends if she gets a chance. Hardeman to bring it in. Bruton has found some space. Normally delivers. Smith. Can she find a teammate? King is hard to beat one-on-one. -on -one. Heads towards half forward. The Ruse moving the ball well. Garner. She's run into trouble. That's wasteful. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. The Tigers have got out of jail. Lynch, Hosking, Conti. Good kick. Yasir in some space on the wing. She's lost it. Garner, desperate to win it back. Navigated the traffic. King, cop some unwanted attention. Riddell, thought her way through it. This is great ball movement. What a hand pass. Well played, her vision was excellent. She's going for home, and why wouldn't she with a finish like that? It eases the pressure on the forwards when you have midfielders chipping in. The ruse will not lie down. Important clearance here. Bruton. King only knows one way. She'll be sore tomorrow. They're going nowhere, and we'll have a stoppage near the centre. Great ruck work. Egan on the spot to lay the tackle. And we'll have another ball up. Rennie with the tap. Egan, her field kicking is normally first rate. McKenzie, inside 50 with the kick. Wakefield, demanded the footy and got it. This is a tall order, but if anyone can do it, it's her. Accuracy and distance might both be problems here. Good disciplined defence. Happy to concede a behind. Hardeman goes towards half-back. Gavalis read it well and claims the mark. Probing ball. Bruton. What she got on offer? Slick hands. Garner. They're a big chance here. Thumped away. Carney. Three in a row coming up. What a patch they're having. That's a great reward for work ethic. She deserved that goal. This is a ding-dong battle. Both sides unrelenting in their attack on the footy. Rennie with a deft tap. Bruton, Garner, good-looking kick. They're moving the football well here. Can she impose herself on the match? Riddell can go back and shoot a goal. She'll give them the lead if she can hold her nerve. Liked it off the boot. That's going close. They've hit the front for the first time today. Can they go on with it now? The Roos have the edge, but they're in a scrap. Don't worry about that. Big clearance to win here. Riddell trying to find a pathway through. Bruton delivers it inside 50. Punched away. Cox. McKenzie does well under pressure. Kelly. 
This will be their first entry for a while. Lynch has it within range. She struggled to make an impact to this point. Egan has marked in front of goal. She's not on the board yet. That should change here. Set sail for home and delivers. If you can get a few goals from your midfielders, it makes you far less predictable. The Tigers really needed that goal just to settle things down. Rennie showing her skills. Bruton is there in the clinches. Garner gathers in the centre square, going at her second. Punched away. That's smart play, really. There's no point taking unnecessary risks. She's off. Miller goes towards half-back. Hosking has a vice-like grip. She might have thought about the corridor. Wakefield. Good hands. Yasir. The Tigers look well-drilled. Honours the lead. Who's at home? Smith clears the area. McKenzie. Snap around the body. It's there. Three goals straight, and she's certainly making the most of her opportunities. The goals are coming thick and fast. This is great to watch. Rennie has rucked tirelessly. Bruton. Riddell takes the hand pass. Carney. Good build-up. She's drawn a crowd. She's got two already. Wall gets to the drop, and they'll get the goal in the end. Forwards dream of these shots. Goes for the check side. Yes! That is so skillful. They had to be patient, but they were able to pick their way through and eventually score. We've got a great contest. Hope you're enjoying it at home. Rennie, the winner there. Bruton leading from the front. Garner. It's one for the high flyers. No wonder the forwards are frustrated. Can she hit a target? Miller. That one was always hers. Kicks to space. Conti. Great vision there. McKenzie. She doesn't waste many. Egan. Good handball. Crosses the arc. Wakefield. Drops into the hole and marks. A bit of wriggle room if she can kick this. They like it behind the goals. She's got it. They produced a clinical finish there to cap off a terrific passage of play. The Tigers have got the margin back beyond a goal. Bruton, short pass, looks good. That's not 15. Throws it on the boot. Hosking tries to spike it out of the danger zone. Graham, no easy exit. No one able to clear the footy, so we'll have another ball up. Who can get the clearance? Egan, solid tackle. Kelly, this is promising. Conti works hard to present. The Ruse have denied them the corridor. Gavalis belts it clear. Yasir. No one can mark. It's a hot footy. They've given it back. Couldn't get an effective disposal. Gets the kick away. Rennie got to the right position and hung on. Riddell. Brown, they've worked it well. The defense has fallen down. Sheeran saw that coming. The Ruse forcing them out wide. Carney belts it clear. She ran into a brick wall. Their appeals have fallen on deaf ears. Rennie wins the tap. Garner, that's a miss kick. Sheeran belts it clear. And finally over the line. Miller goes towards half back. The great Spud Frawley would have loved that one and will have a throw in. Lots to analyse. Half, what stands out? It's been good to see both sides hitting the scoreboard. This is an enjoyable game of footy. Rennie wins it down. Garner is a real pocket rocket. Bruton in the right spot. We'll be all square if she converts. We're all square. They might want to tighten up on her. They gave her too much space on that occasion and she made the most of it. Back on terms again. Matza, the winner there. King, Garner. She is everywhere at the moment. Punched away. You can never question her commitment. Fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. The umpire will have it. 
Matza wins the hit out. Bruton. It's there. The Tigers are all at sea trying to defend them. They're scoring almost at will. The Roos are really taking it to them today. Matza is giving her a bit of a bath. Bruton. King. She's got two already. Never looked to have the distance. That's good vision. Mackenzie with a chance to relieve the pressure. Plays the percentages. Cox gets to the front spot. Heads towards the half forward flank. Randall got a fist in. Kylie. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? They might be a little unlucky not to be rewarded there. It was a fine tackle. Matza has been dominant in the ruck. Garner doesn't want to turn it over there. They'll be sore in the morning. Kylie going at her second. She's missed. The Ruse will breathe a sigh of relief that that turnover didn't cost them. Hardeman heads wide with the kick in. That's well played. What can they generate? Good thinking and good execution too. Picking their way through. Quality delivery by foot. Miller went bang. Egan. Inside 50 with the kick. She's plucked it and she should have a shot. That was great use of the body. She's so hard to beat in those situations. This for the lead. Looks good off the boot. They're in front. That's a quality finish. She's a beautiful kick at goal when her confidence is up. Neither side giving an inch. What a contest we're seeing. Matza wins it out of the centre. King needing support. Miller runs onto it. Kicks to centre wing. Egan. A good kick here and they'll be in business. Mackenzie. They cannot keep her quiet. The Tigers moving the ball well. Goes very wide. Shevlin marks. Will she go the bomb? She's goalless so far, but this would be a great way to get on the score sheet. It'll take her best. Not looking likely, a behind. That's a rare miss. They've been deadly accurate today. Hardeman to bring it in. As Dennis would say, that kick was certainly to perfect. She's hit up the lead. Happy to be patient and wait for an opening. Strong grab. Takes a beauty. No one can mark. Hosking. Now it's someone else's problem. Lynch delivers to centre half forward. No wonder coaches go grey. She's generally a good kick. Right. Thumped away. Gathers it cleanly on the wing. Garner. This deserves a goal. Sheeran belts it clear. King does the crumbing. That looks on line. It is on line. They've hit the front. That's what happens when you leave players in space inside 50. It hurts you on the scoreboard. We've had five lead changes now. Seymour wins the tap. Hosking, Egan, under pressure. Gets her kick despite the heat. Wakefield, outside of the boot. That's a bit of a waste. She's so clean with the footy. Smith. Whatever she's suffering from, it's not leather poisoning. Dempsey takes an excellent grab. Seymour. She's got an option in the centre square. Thumped away. Bresnahan puts her head over it. Sets a task for the forwards. No one can mark. Abitangelo. That could be a goal-saving tackle. Garner runs in and bangs it home. The Roos just keep hitting the scoreboard. Eight goals for the quarter now. So a timely goal late in the piece. Shevlin, she's run into trouble. Can't afford to give it back in the corridor. Out wide with the kick. Carney. Hosking went bang. Look at her go. That's skillful. King. For a three goal game, it's there. They've pinched a break. It's not for nothing. The third quarter is known as the Premiership quarter. The Roos are taking it right up to their more fancied opponents. Seymour palmed it down beautifully. Hosking, feeling the heat, blasts away. Ferguson belts it clear. Levy curls it around. This is a chance. It's a big chance. 
She's a terrific asset with her pace and skills, and that was another example. The Tigers snare a badly needed goal. Seymour with the tap. Shevlin, she'll be sore tomorrow. Egan, well done. Towards full forward. Oh my word, up, up and away. She'll expect to convert this. It's on the way, good looking kick, and she's dobbed it. Isn't footy more fun when forwards are kicking big bags? The Tigers, with a late one on the verge of three quarter time. Great ruck work, Shevlin. Momentum has shifted, Hosking on a lead. The defence is disorganised. Reed can go back and shoot at goal. I'm not sure she's got the journey from there. There's the kick, and she's put it through. She had the opportunity to put them in front, and that's exactly what she's done. Lovely finish. That's the end of a great quarter of footy. Two teams having a real go. It's been a quality contest. Let's head down to half on the boundary. A close, high-scoring game. What more could you want? Some of the forwards are enjoying themselves, and it always feels like the next goal isn't far away. Having said that, if either midfield can find a way to better protect their defenders, that'll go a long way towards winning the match. Thanks for those observations, half, as we get back underway. Shevlin, another forward 50 entry. Hosking is the target, and she marks. This would give them some breathing space. She's a good set shot, and she's buried that one. A midfielder who consistently hits the scoreboard is a valuable commodity. The Tigers leading it by eight points. Big clearance to win here. Bruton, there goes the kick inside the 50. Takes on the responsibility, just needs to finish, and finish she does. They've kicked well at goal, and it certainly helped to keep them in the game. The Roos have trimmed the margin back to two points. Important clearance here. Shevlin, so influential today, honours the lead. Look at the distance on that hand pass. It's a goal! She managed to find some space in a dangerous position and made them pay for their loose checking. The Tigers are doing enough to keep their noses in front. Seymour, the winner there. They've got a good understanding, those two. Egan has got off the chain. Cox goes at goal, but I think that's going the wrong side of the post. It is. It's a behind. Well, that was a promising build-up and deserved a better finish. Brown with the footy. Randall is hard to beat one-on-one. -on -one. And they're away. Graham belts it clear. Egan, what a game she's having. Wakefield, it's a desperate tackle. Closed her down. The Tigers with a chance for a stoppage goal. Matza smashes it out of there. King, Bruton, Smith. She hasn't been herself today. No one can mark. Miller absorbing the pressure. Quick kick towards centre half forward. Hardiman went bang. Gavalis. The Tigers guarding the corridor. Bruton. That might attract a pack. Sheeran belts it clear. She's not one to take a backward step. This might be a chance for the High Flyers. Right. Wins it back. Great mark. Kicks the half forward. Hosking belts it clear. Miller. Solid tackle. Some indirect ball movement here. The umpires pinged her for insufficient intent. Centers it. Brown has a vice-like grip. It's one of those ones that should be kicked, but it's amazing how often players miss them. She's normally dependable, and she is this time. Terrific goal there. She's so dangerous in front of the sticks. Away we go once more. Seymour looking for territory. Hosking, not sure who that was meant for, but it's been picked off. King takes the logical option. Garner, 
It's a thumping kick. Is it big enough? No one can mark. Gets it to safety. Sheeran with the footy. Seymour can keep it moving. A chance to clear now. Dempsey working hard and presenting well. Garner belts it clear. That might have been dropping the ball. Egan needs to be quick. Towards half forward with the kick. No one can mark. Wall and out it goes. The Roos might be behind on the scoreboard, but they're giving a very good account of themselves. Matza has rucked tirelessly. King is a dynamo. Bruton, she just keeps racking up disposals. None of them could stop her. She read it superbly. Garner has been a real live wire. Smith heads for home. It's close. What does the goal umpire say? The Tigers have got to make sure they keep taking the game on. Going too defensive too early would play into the opposition's hands. Back into play. Generosity is a wonderful quality, but not on a football field. The Ruse have been gallant. Smith has it at half forward. She's had little impact so far. Punched away, and they see it out. How's it look down there, half? The Ruse aren't getting much value out of their clearance dominance, and that could be very deflating. Kelly, the winner there. Hosking, in the thick of it as ever. No one can mark. Wall made the footy hers. Boot to ball just in time. Got to get rid of it. Bends it around the body. That's on target and through it goes. So often she provides great energy for them up front and she's done it again. Who would know who's going to win this? Rennie has had her measure today. Riddell, Garner, Smith running in support. King. The Tigers have a chance to push back now. Eddie runs onto it, going at her first, and she's got it. It's a gift, really, and she has taken full advantage. Finals footy at its best. We've been treated to a classic. Rennie has been dominant in the ruck. King, good thinking and good execution too. Garner, this will be another one. They can do no wrong. They've got five for the quarter now, and there's time for more too. The Roos are playing some great football. They're threatening to run away with this match. Rennie is giving her a bit of a bath. King on the same page as her ruck. Carney, can they get another one? No one can mark. Miller, she put herself in the line of fire. Brown has two today, and you can make it three. Crafty forward play there. She reads the ball so well, and she's one of those who can hurt you without having big disposal numbers. The Roos have got it on their terms here. Rennie wins it out of the centre. King, she stopped in her tracks. She's hit up the lead. That's an aggressive handball. Riddell heads long towards goal. She's got the distance, but not the accuracy. Miller brings it back in. Smith belts it clear. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. Lots to analyse, Daniel. What stands out? The Roos have made some mistakes, but they haven't been deterred. They just keep creating opportunities. King. That is going very close. The Tigers are in danger of being blown away. Their midfielders need to lift and start exerting more pressure. Sheeran with the footy. Mackenzie has it. She's been a rare shining light for them today. Gives it everything. Right. Belts it clear. Kylie. They'll be sore in the morning. They are still cracking in hard deep into this game. Rennie with a deft tap. Conti read it best. Egan. Finally, they go inside 50. Ferguson went bang. You see her. It's not the best kick. Has she done enough? A goal there would have set the cat among the pigeons. Hardeman to bring it in. The Ruse have winners everywhere. Bresnahan, they're playing with purpose and composure. Brown, clever handball. That's unusual. McKenzie absorbs the pressure. Time is starting to become a factor here. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. King, Riddell, Smith. The Tigers, a chasing tail. Brown, on the end of it, they're cutting them up with their ball movement. She's three from three. Can she maintain a perfect record? A 
A simple finish, and she makes no mistake. Marks inside 50 are worth their weight in gold when you go back and convert the goal. The ruse clearly didn't read the script. They were supposed to struggle today. Rennie showing her skills. Riddell, they're hungry for more. Miller belts it clear. It's a hot footy. Garner, what a game she's having. She's drilled her fourth. They've been consistently able to find avenues to goal through quick and direct ball movement. We thought this one might be close, but it hasn't turned out that way. Rennie wins it down. Bruton. Brown. She's set upon. Carney, the ruse, are finishing with a wet sail. They're running on top of the ground at the moment and playing an excellent brand of football. It'll take a good kick from there, but that one's not coming back. You can't blame her for having a crack. She's having a terrific game. Sheeran tasked with the kick in. Quality delivery by foot. It's a high ball. Hosking. Can she be the fire starter? Randall belts it clear. Kelly. She'll be annoyed at herself letting the tackle slip high. Clever kick. Mackenzie on a lead. Heads for the pocket. Punched away. Gavalis. Got to get it out of there. You can see their confidence growing. Carney. The ruse can smell blood. Riddell. They're running rings around them. They've got winners all over the park. Gee, they're playing well. They're irrepressible at the moment. Miller is there in defence. Goes laterally. Not often you see a forward spoiling the ball. It's a goal. She hasn't missed one yet, and she hasn't looked like missing. What a game she's having. The ruse in this form would challenge anyone. Rennie wins the hit out. Riddell. Wall. She's so good in close. Carney. It's a thumping kick. Is it big enough? She's got it. They're really opening them up, and right now they have no answers to the onslaught. Well, that's one lopsided looking scoreboard. Rennie gets her hand to it. Bruton should be in the votes today. Garner, searching kick. Brown drops into the hole and marks. That won't make the distance. Dempsey ensures there's no second chance. Graham works hard to present. The Tigers might be able to start something. Hosking playing for pride now. Bruton belts it clear. Cox is cool under pressure. The foot race is on on the wing. Turnover in the middle. This could hurt. Dishes it off. Randall. Sends them inside 50 again. Miller at centre half back. Not a lot of positives today. The Tigers have got out of jail. She's been quiet. Their coach is going to lose it in a minute. Just has to hit a target. Punched away. Graham. Can she mop up? Dangerous place to lose it. Miller moving the football laterally. As Dennis would say, that kick was centimetre perfect. Hosking. This is more positive. Egan. Cox. They need to hit the scoreboard here. Able to keep the ball for one of the few times today. It's been a dark day, but that was a more positive passage of play, and it should result in a goal. Into the pocket she goes. Bresnahan taking no chances. The Tigers are having a go. They're just having one of those days where nothing is going right. Great ruck work. Bruton, Bresnahan, hasn't seen a lot of it. They are a pleasure to watch. The Ruse finishing strongly. Miller accepted the invitation. Terrific tackle. Sheeran, what can she do with it? No way through that traffic, so they'll reset. Punched clear. Bruton, Riddell. Just had to get it out. Carney. It's there. 
There aren't many teams who can go with them when they're playing like this. They're firing on all cylinders. The Tigers are having one of those days. Everything that could go wrong has gone wrong. Riddell under pressure. Bruton. They're leading them a merry dance. Sheeran went bang. No easy exit. Graham Dempsey. She's besieged. This spells trouble. It's a goal. She's really set them alight in that forward line, playing that small forward role beautifully. The Roos are giving them an absolute belting. Rennie wins it. Riddell not wanting to bomb to a contest. Garner, it's a dominant display. Gets up high and manages to hold on. Sensational grab. To put the cherry on top of what has been a superlative performance. Heads to the goal and does not let them down. The Roos are going from strength to strength. Everything they touch turns to gold. What a result. They'll be delighted with this. Bruton, a bit of a nothing kick. Garner, they are a delight to watch. Carney, working hard and presenting well. Riddell, needs that to come back. An ugly looking scoreboard should probably be looking even uglier. Miller with the footy. Egan has found some space. Ignoring the corridor for now. Randall intercepts on centre wing. Doesn't often waste it. Carney has it at half forward. I've liked her game today. Bruton marks. Will she go the bomb? The Tigers have no answers. She'll be sore tomorrow. The umpire calls for it as the final siren approaches. Seymour palmed it down beautifully. Mackenzie, Egan, working hard and being rewarded. Can she find a teammate? Normally delivers. Defence 101 there. Hardeman, that's a bruising tackle. The umpire whistles for a ball up. Seymour smashes it out of there. She's caught. Kylie. It's almost over, but can they get themselves a consolation goal? Seymour has rucked tirelessly. She's missed. Kicking behind is contagious. They'll hope the disease doesn't spread any further. Final siren. There was only ever one winner today. That is a comprehensive victory, and they will be delighted with their performance. Thanks so much for joining us. Hope you can be with us again for the next match. Until then, it's bye for now.